All right, uh, Adam Swickle, from my perspective, someone who does what this woman did. Obviously, it's not a murder case, right? I'm not asking for life in prison. But this is not someone who should just uh, get an order of restitution for money that, like many criminal defendants, she may never pay back to these people. Uh, she needs to go away because we need to deter her and others from trying to do things like this, which is take advantage of the compassion of your fellow human being. I agree with you, Vinny, and, and I heard what the prosecution said, and um, I remember being on your show when uh, Mr. Schwartz was uh, asked similar questions about plea deals, and I'm a little confused because from what I'm hearing today, there were a lot more plea discussions and possibly lesser requests for a sentence than what we heard when Mr. Schwartz was here. I believe he had spoken about the best plea deal being three years, but I got to tell you, while I agree that some form of incarceration may be appropriate in this case, I think that the length of incarceration really is a product of what I've talked about a lot before, and that is this case has a lot of pressure on it. A lot of pressure given by the community, given by the public, and in which this is why I've always said it never should have been tried here. It was too much pressure on the judge, too much pressure on the prosecution, and too much pressure on the community to make sure that she paid for what she did. I've handled hundreds of theft cases, some small, some a lot larger, but I have never seen a case where somebody has stole money of $16,000 get this type of sentence. And I'm talking about burglaries, I'm talking about bank robberies, I'm talking about a lot of situations where you just don't see this kind of severe sentence on top of restitution. I think some form of lesser jail time, either through plea discussions before a trial, would have been probably something a little more uh, reasonable to take, because let's face it, case never should have gone to trial for the defense.